hey everyone welcome back to my channel for today's video i am going to be sharing a few layering combos that i have been into lately i have been playing so much with bath and body works and victoria's secret lotions and creams and mists if you are new to my channel welcome my name is amy i do videos on fragrance beauty body care and self-care if you love all of that then please consider subscribing and hitting the notification bell so that you are notified whenever i upload a new video and if you are a returning subscriber welcome back how are you guys doing today i am so happy to have you here with me and i am super grateful for all of the love and support with that said let's go ahead and let's get started with today's video i have quite a few layering combos here and i have been working on a few more but i wanted to give you guys these because i recently got all of those new goodies from the bath and body works semi-annual sale so i know i'm gonna start playing with a bunch more and i don't want to forget to share these with you first i mentioned in my bath and body works haul that i love to watch ai the great jasmine bullard takara thompson Another channel that I have been loving for layering combos and ideas is Simply Shaughnessy. I love her channel as well. She does a lot of body care videos and I love watching those as well. So yeah, those are some of the channels that I have just been enjoying to watch when it comes to layering. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to get started with my favorite combos lately. So the first combo that I am going to be sharing is Burberry Her and i have been pairing burberry her with victoria's secret strawberries and champagne these two go together so beautifully the strawberries and champagne lotion is so sweet and just it takes me back to like high school days and then the burberry her just adds like a grown touch to it so that it's not too juvenile for me but I love these two paired together and this one made Burberry Her last so long on me. I wore it to bed the other night and it just smelled so good, so fresh and juicy and sweet. Beautiful combo and I'm just super obsessed. And ever since I went ahead and paired these two together, I have been making a bigger dent on my Burberry Her because I have just been addicted to the way that these two smell together next we're gonna go ahead and talk about my one of my favorite notes and it is almond a few months ago i discovered almond blossom from bath and body works this lotion is pretty much almost done and i have the fragrance mist which is to the top because this one was a backup that i had but i don't use the fragrance mist as fast as i do the lotions and body creams but this one is sweet almond oil blended with vanilla orchid and cashmere musk this right here is perfect for any fragrances that you might have that are almond dominant so the first pairing that i would love to talk about is of course my favorite almond blossom and girl of now by ellie saab these two go so beautifully together Ugh. the almond in here is so so good i had a body wash of this i used up the entire body wash and i have backups of this scent because it is just one of my favorites so girl of now is a good one to pair with it also aqua di parma mandorlo di sicilia will go so perfect with this as well i haven't done this one yet but i tried it out and i loved it so i need to give it a few more wears i just kind of like sprayed the mist with this one to see if it would smell good and it did so and then the next one that this pairs beautifully with and this is the main reason why i got this one is to go with valentino donna aqua and they smell pretty much identical so the smell that you get here is pretty much the opening of valentino donna aqua which is a bummer because this fragrance smells so so good in the opening and then it kind of just goes away so i wanted to find a way to hang on to that opening 
This is like an almond pistachio. It's just so good. Oh my God. And then if you were to spray this on there, yes, this adds that almond touch that gets lost after a few minutes in this fragrance. You're able to keep it longer. So if you have this one and you wish that the almond lasted a little bit longer on it, go ahead and give those a try and you will love it. The next combo is a combo that I did the other night. I instantly fell in love with this combo and I'm going to be doing it for the rest of the summer because it is a juicy, peachy, just such a refreshing, beautiful combo. And that is Miss Dior Blooming Bouquet. And I went ahead and I paired it with just Peachy from Bath and Body Works. And I also used the Fragrance Mist for this combo this right here smells amazing i'm gonna go ahead and spray a strip again with the body spray and then the fragrance on top mm, this is a peach bomb if you love peach the first time that i tried this one i wasn't sure if i was going to keep it but it grew on me and i am obsessed and then layered with this one which this one has peach and i believe I don't know, I don't remember. Peach, apricot. Yes, this combo, guys, is so good. If you want a summery, peachy fragrance, try this combo out. The Blooming Bouquet, I get the peach in it, but to bring the peach out even more, I layered it with those two and it was a match made in heaven. I absolutely love that. And the lotion, having all of those layers is just going to keep you smelling so good for way longer than if you were just to spray the perfume. So these are amazing together. Next combo that I'm going to be sharing with you guys is one that I wore to my dad's house not too long ago. It was on 4th of July. We were pretty much outside the whole time. He did burgers on the grill and we spent most of our time outside. And I am so happy that I wore this fragrance because it was perfect for that day. And this is Guerlain's Aqua Allegoria Coconut Fizz. And I went ahead and paired that with Victoria's Secret's Coconut Passion. So these paired together are just stunning. Pretty much anything with coconut is going to smell good with this one. I just really like how this one is not a creamy coconut it's more like a watery coconut so it goes really well with this one you could pair it with the other coconut from bath and body works but this one to me is more of a creamy coconut and i preferred i tried both of them out together but i preferred this one so i'm going to do the same thing just to refresh my memory so good yes it is just so so good usually aqua allegoria fragrances don't last a long time on many people but with this combo i smelled myself for more than four hours the whole way to my dad's house is already an hour away and then when i got there i smelled myself for a few more hours after that and this is just a fresh coconut just refreshing type of scent so good this next combo i haven't done it in a really long time because it's been really hot i did this one a few months ago i mean it's always warm here in puerto rico but lately i've just been focusing more on very summery type of fragrances but i wanted to give this combo because i did like it when i tried it out and this is la vie belle intense mint and I paired it with Raspberry Tangerine from Bath & Body Works. I love how most of them look super cute with the packaging. So this combo was really nice. It just gave, it just brought out the raspberry more in the La Vie Belle Intensement. Yeah, this one is super sweet, citrusy. You still get the tangerine as well. Mm. 
mm, paired together is just so good it just brings out a little bit more of that raspberry in the La Via Bell. And they smell really good, really sweet, mixed together. I really like that combo as well. And for summer, if you wanted to wear this maybe like on a summer night, this will help kind of like lighten it up a bit because this one's nice, but I feel like it could be a little thick some days. So if you want to layer it with the body mist, it will help to make it a little bit more wearable sweet but tangy at the same time this next combo i have showed it in a previous video but this is the dolce and gabbana light blue sun and i have been pairing this one with coconut lime from bath and body works and these go together so so good this one is a refreshing Combo and it is just perfect for summer days. This one is so good. You have to like lemon, lime because it's a very citrusy combo. But this one will have you feeling so fresh, so just mm so refreshed for summer this is like the perfect summer combo right here if you like to smell citrusy fresh coconutty it's one of my favorites that i have been doing this summer and i just wanted to share it with you guys it is just amazing the next one i have two fragrances to go with this cream and body mist so i'm going to be talking about the coconut the coconut body cream and mist from bath and body works this one is coconut milk sea salt musk and fresh vanilla and i love to pair this one with dolce and gabbana the only one intense yeah the only one intense i love to pair these together it just gives it it brings out more of the coconut in this one because sometimes I don't pick up as much coconut in this one. So it helps to add a coconut body mist to it. If you really want that coconut. Mm, it is, it's so good together. I really, really like that combo. Yes so good if you add this to it you're gonna get more of that coconut i have heard some people on youtube saying that they don't pick up that much coconut in this one or that sometimes they pick it up and sometimes they don't so adding a coconut cream and body mist will definitely help the other one that i pair with the coconut body mist is opinionated scent's favorite scent in the world and this is versace crystal noir I'm just kidding. She hates this fragrance. She doesn't like it at all. But I love to pair these two together. It just brings out the coconut in this one as well. Okay, so coconut and then putting this one on top. Yes, so good. Mmm. This, I don't know what I'm going to do when I run out of this coconut one because I'm already like halfway through this one. I'm probably going to have to search for it on eBay or something or maybe they'll come out with it again next year for summer. But this is definitely one of my favorite lines that they have released is the coconut line. I absolutely love it. All right, and here is the last combo that I did last night. I have been playing more with my Lancome Idol. I still have mixed feelings about this one because I love the way it smells but if I spray too much of this one I will get a headache so last night I did like six sprays and I think I could do maybe like a little bit less with this one because I still felt a little like it was too much at times but I did go ahead and pair it with the rose lotion from Bath and Body Works and these two go together so nice and my pjs this morning were still smelling like this combo it's amazing this scent does have rose in it so i wanted to bring out a little bit of that rose and this combo is beautiful it's girly it's 
like a flirty girly type of scent and it's really really nice so i think i'm gonna keep on using it even though i would like to get through this bottle because it is a small bottle and i do want to try the intense version of this one to see if it's maybe more of my style because i did read that it had a little bit more i'm not sure if it was spiciness to it but that would be beautiful because i do love that so those are all of the combos that i have been loving lately i hope that you guys enjoyed this video please comment down below any combos that you guys enjoy to do and any of the combos that i mentioned if there's any that you are interested in trying give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it please subscribe if you haven't subscribed thank you for being here with me today and i will see you guys in my next video